Hi everyone, this is the Gas Walkthrough for August 28th. I'm Bill Newman. Today I'm solving Figure Sudoku by Bill Murphy. Um, I actually did one of these earlier in the month. Uh, we had a little bit of a mix-up, and I ended up making something that Bill was already planning to make. But that's okay. Um, you could still have guessed that we would duplicate something, I guess. Um, anyway, normal Sudoku rules. 1 to 9 in each row, column, and 3 by 3 box. Additionally, we have some figures in the grid. They are all shaped the same, um, and they must contain the same digits, but they don't have to be in the same positions. So these aren't clones, but they work a little bit like clones. Um, it's just the set of digits is repeated, not the order. And those are the rules. Um, so we can see there's a 2, a 4, a 6, and a 7 in one of these cages. So those digits must appear in all of the cages. And we have a mystery fifth digit. Um, so let's see what we can do with the digits that we already know about. Um, seven can't go in these cells, so it must go here. Um, six can't go in these, so it must go in one of these. Seven also can't go in these, so this is actually a six, seven pair, which means four is in one of these. Uh, two can't go in these, so this is a two. And one of these is a six. This can't be two, so two's in one of these. This can't be four. Uh, these can't be seven. Uh, the four is going to be up here. I'm going to mark that because they're all in the same box. Four can't go in that cell. All right, a little bit of Sudoku before we keep going. Um, in this row, we just need the even digits. We have four and six here, so this must be the eight. And this is a 4-6 pair, but we have a 6-7 here, so this is 4, which makes that 4. And this is 6. So this is also not 6. Um, so this is either 2 or, or a missing digit. We can actually figure out which it is. We have 2 in the row here. We also know 2 is in one of these cells, so it's not here. So this must be the 2. Um, our remaining digits here, we need a 5. It's got to go there. 4 can't go here. And this is a 3. So we have 2 and the missing digit here. Um, we have 6 and the missing digit here. We have 4 and 6 and the missing digit here. Uh, these are 1, 3. These are 6 and 7. Oh, we can do that. Just missing the 7 sitting right there. Uh, 9 and 8 here. Alright, let's look at this missing digit. I'm going to color it purple. If this is the missing digit, well, it can't go here. It must go here. So this must be the 2. So what can this digit be? It's not 2, 4, 6, or 7. Those are already in the cage and see the digit somewhere. Um, Note that the rules don't say that digits can't repeat. Um, you could definitely have a figure Sudoku with repeated digits. As long as you're repeating the digit in every cage, that's fine. Uh, but in this case, it doesn't work. Um, so, not 2, 4, 6, 7, not 5, not 3, not 9. Uh, that leaves 1 and 8, I believe. And I don't think we can resolve that yet. So let's put 1, 8 here. These are 1, 6, and 8. And this can't be 8. These are 1, 4, 6, 8. This can't be 8. Our pencil marks a little bit. And now let's just look for some Sudoku. So in this column, we still need a 6, but it's 6 is in one of these, so it's not here. So this is 6. These are 1, 8, 9. Um, and that's going to leave 2 and 3 to go in these cells. These are 1, 4, 6, and 9. The 9 can't go here, so it must go here. This is 1 or 4. Uh, these are 1, 3, 8, and not 8. There's an 8 here, so that's going to make 8 the mystery digit. And that's going to resolve our cages which is nice. Uh, that's a 1. Uh, 7 and 6 are done. 
Is that six? I'm gonna highlight all of these just for completeness. Um, need a four in one of these, five in one of these. Uh, six must go here, and that's gonna resolve all of those. And this is two. Uh, this is one, three, or nine, but it's not one, three, so it must be the nine. These are three, four, seven. These are one and five. These are, uh, we need an eight here, four, seven for the other cell. These are one, three, five. Uh, two in one of those. Can't do that yet. Uh, four, nine here we can do. It's going to give us our seven. Four goes here, so the two goes there. These are one and three. These are one and two. We can do that. And finish it off. That's the solution. Um, I I love this puzzle. This is a really good puzzle. Um, I like how much you can do with the cages. Um, knowing four of the digits, you can fill in some of those digits, and then the last one holds out for a little bit. Um, you've eventually got to find this eight here uh, to place the eight. So. I, I hope you enjoyed that as much as I did. Um, I'm, I haven't looked yet. I'm curious to see how many people guessed what variant I'm posting today based on this puzzle. Um, I think some people got tripped up a little bit. Um, but we're almost at the end of our guessing game for the month. And um, I guess my next video, I may be doing a. Uh, walkthrough of what the rule was. So um, if you have a chance, take a look at this month's puzzles and see if you can figure it out before we reveal it. Uh, but anyway, I will see you next time. Bye for now.